idea that we had to learn a set subject for a lot of people who could learn all together. It really inspires me and I'm sure others as well to the value of the Torah study that people can have even while they are busy a whole day out making a living out in the workplace. Every afternoon I come to the Kol so we can learn Mikvos. It's a great opportunity to be able to learn in a place for the Kol Torah. It's very easy to get lost and caught up in life and responsibilities. For my life to uh, carve out a piece of my day that I can come and learn is a tremendous blessing. Keeping me connected to Torah and, and mitzvahs and uh, it, it spills over into my family. Torah studies for everyone, no matter how much time you have, if it's five minutes, if it's 15 minutes, if it's five hours, but there's a place for you in the base Medrash, there's a place for you in Torah, and we have people coming in from all walks of life, Jews from all over the place, learning so many different subjects. I learned Masech HaSimua to Kolo. I learned about free will with the Denver Kolo. I learned about the Shamas. I learned about cremation. More in-depth knowledge of the Torah. Many things about the Jewish holidays. I learned when the people ask questions on what you taught. Moses went up three times for the tablets. The essence of life. How to connect with Hashem. Kuzari, Halevi, and then the Maharal we've been reading. There are so many people coming in, learning so many different things, and it's so, such a beautiful thing to hear the din, the noise of a base medrash. It doesn't matter if you're learning in the kolo, it doesn't matter if you're learning at home, you're learning in a shul or in a base medrash somewhere else. We invite you to come learn, learn somewhere, learn something. Five minutes, half an hour, an hour, whatever it is. People of the book, despite exile so yearning and hoping with the tire of song, Mashiach's arrival, a regeneration with the tire of love. It's the heartbeat of our nation.